Ron, we'll talk to you then. Thank you. The Lubbock County Expo Center Board says it's making great strides in reaching its financial go and fundraising goal. Just $7 million away from breaking ground on construction. KMX Cameron Mendoza has a look at how the board plans to raise the rest of the money they need to get the project back on track. Brian and Lauren, the Lubbock County Expo Center has been in the works for more than five years now. And although construction is still on hold, board members and county officials say the day they hit that fundraising goal is not far off. I, w I would tell you that we'll be doing handsprings right down the middle of Broadway. Uh, it certainly will be a relief. While Randy Jordan and the Lubbock County Expo Center Board of Directors are not quite to the finish line just yet, they're keeping the momentum up as they continue to fundraise for the new Expo Center. Nobody wants it any more than our board. When you go back and look that our board came together in 2017, we led the, the battle in 2018 for the to get the vote. Uh, and since then, we've all had things that have occurred to us, and now we're all operating on the heels of things that none of us had control of. Jordan says between COVID and inflation on building materials, that's kept the groundbreaking out of reach these last few years. But as of lately, the tides are turning and progress is gaining speed. We're the closest we've been uh, to getting our fundraising go. Uh, costs have gone up for everybody, uh, including construction costs. So we've had to deal with that. But uh, uh, as, of, as of the end of April, and here we are at 1st of May, we're within $7 million of, what, of the private side. It looks good because it comes from the hotel tax. That's visitor's tax. While Gary Boren says the county side of the funds are ready to go thanks to the hot tax implemented by voters in 2018. It's a great thing for Lubbock to have this. We hope to break ground and we're excited about the opportunities, uh, how the finances is coming together and how the, the money has come together. So it's a great thing for Lubbock. It's a jewel of the South Plains. While the jewel is still a diamond in the rough, Jordan says once that last seven million is raised, Lubbock will have a facility that was worth the wait. I love to give everybody exact timelines, but that's something I can't give you today. We're still working every day, diligently. We just need everybody's help. We need everybody's patience, but we're going to get there. And Jordan says they hope they can raise quite a bit more money at this weekend's Expo Nanza, which will happen at the Civic Center with dinner, live music, auctions, and raffles to try to get those dollars that will hopefully get them over the finish line. For more information on the Expo Nanza or donating to the Expo Center, we'll have that linked on everythinglubbock.com.